Hey, are you looking for a place to maybe eat some great food, explore some culture, and dance the night away? Well, all that and more is coming right here to DFW in about 15 days. Joining us this morning is Miguel Castro, the Community and Marketing Director of Carne Asada Fest. Good morning to you. Hey, good morning. How are you? I'm doing well. Glad to have you here. So tell us more about this huge festival. So the festival is a music and food festival, as you stated. We want to make sure to elaborate that. The food part, it's a big part of yes, our festival, is. right? We get like a lot of the best street food vendors here in Dallas Ooh. award winning. So you got to make sure that you're eating good while you're enjoying the music, um, listening to all of the amazing headliners that we have, some of the local acts that we have. So it's a little bit of both inside and outside festival. So just to make sure, I know the Texas Heat, we were just talking about it. Okay, so you in can and come out. inside, enjoy the music, eat the food and some AC too, and walk around a bit. So as you stated, it's a Memorial Day weekend on the 26th coming up in three Sundays. So you know, be sure to be there if you can. Uh, the weather is usually beautiful on that Sunday. Right. Too. Mark it on your calendar. Miguel, is there a reason why this is named after such an iconic Hispanic dish? It is the Carne Asada Fest. It's, so it's usually like a party, right? We in the Hispanic community yes. have. Um, we have them for baptisms, right? For birthday parties, for kindergarten graduations. Mm -hmm. So we name it the Carne Asada Fest because it's all inviting, right? It's, it's, it's our party, but we want to invite all of our friends just like we did when Very we were younger. Cool. Right? Small party, but everyone can come and invite your cousins, your moms, your aunts, your friends, your girlfriends. Everyone is invited. Now, every year is kind of different. What's the spin this year? So this year, we're going to have a lot more activations and excited oh. to announce as well that we have multiple stages this year at Gillies. Usually, it's just the main stage, but now we have multiple stages. So we're going to have more artists for all of our attendees to enjoy, too, while they're eating their food. What would you say is the goal for this event when you get people to come on out? The goal is to make sure like we have a fun, exciting, safe event, um, mm. family friendly too. We like to make that clear. Kids 12 and under are free. Like I said, it's, it's every, everyone's invited, right? We're going to have activations, photo booths, uh, the music, the food. It's something for everyone to come enjoy. That's a question that we get a lot in our inbox. Like who can attend? It's everyone. Whether you want to bring your kids, you want to leave them at home too, you want to enjoy it yourself, <laughs> you know, everyone and anyone is invited. So that's what we hope to achieve to make sure we continue to bring that message out, bring communities together, let them enjoy, you know, just a good time. That's what I'm talking about. Now, the fest is coming up on Memorial Day weekend right around the corner. How can people watching this morning get information, get tickets, maybe hear more about the food lineup and the music lineup as well? Right. They can go to our website at carnasadafest.com. Um, and they can visit our social media channels too, Karen Asada underscore Fest on Instagram, mm -hmm. Karen Asada Fest on Facebook. We make sure to put out all the information on there. We just announced the, uh, the official schedule lineup too. Ooh. So if there's a specific artist they want to see, they can go ahead and see them. We have the food vendor lineup too, amazing tacos, pupusas, everything all around. Vegan options too. Um, we're going to have ice creams, paleta, Mexican paleta. So if it's a hot day, you know, come and enjoy That's it. That's what I'm talking about. Miguel, before we go here, any, I mean, artists that we need to know about that we don't want to miss? Yeah, the headliners that we have this year, Rakim and uh, reggaeton singers, Bobby Polito, big, oh, wow. big Tejano artist. Yeah, we're going to have Lil Flip there too. So if you're into the rap scene, we're going to have some Houston legends, Bo Bundy, Ray Burger, a Dallas native, really big DJ, Giovanni and the Higher Gun. So amazing artists. Good thing I asked you about that. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Miguel, thank you so much for joining us this morning here on Daybreak. A pleasure to have you. All right. Thank you. I appreciate it. Of course. Come